Hi, this is Eric Martin with Board Game Geek. I'm here with Carl Briere from Le Scorpion Masqué, looking at Zombie Kids Evolution, uh, which is the, I guess you'd say, the legacy game aimed at the youngest audience out there. Yes, it's the yeah. first kind of legacy game for kids. So but we don't destroy anything, so everything is always there. So we start very with the basic rules. Okay. So we are students, and we want to protect schools against Zombie, which are which is the director or the, the 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 gym professor or things like this. So you really want to control your your school to protect it. So you are all different characters, uh, very cool with special uh, like geek stuff like uh, swords like this and uh, some influence from the uh, uh, walking dead and stuff like that. So rules are very easy. Every player will roll a die to know where a new zombie will arrive. So okay. in that room. Then it's the player's turn to, to move. So they can move from one room to the other or you could also stay there and put back a, a zombie in the reserve. Exactly, so, but they will come back later. So every round, we roll the die to know where they are coming. And the goal of the game is to work in a team, so you need to go in every corner to, to put a lock here. So you need to be two players at the same place to, to be able to lock the door. And you win if all the doors are closed, or you lose if all the zombies arrive on, on the board and you're not able to put any new zombies anymore. Okay. And so it's possible to have two or three zombies in the same room. So if there's three zombies or more, you cannot go there anymore. So they can continue to spawn, so you need to hurry to lock okay. everything. All right. And they never, do they move from room to room at all? or? Uh, no, the, mom, the zombie never moves, so they okay. stay in the room where they, they just spawn. Okay. Yeah. All right. So um, and beyond that, so that is the basic game. That's the game basic one. Games. Exactly, game one. So every game lasts about 10 to 15 minutes, and gradually, every time that we play, you have a sticker that that you will put. So either you win or you lose. Doesn't matter. You will continue in the in the adventure. So okay. you will put this sticker at the end here. So this is where, where you you start your stories actually, okay. and. Like video games, you have some achievement that you, you need to fulfill. So if you're able mm, to win right. at four players, or if you, you're able to win with killing all the zombies and things like this, then you, you will unlock new achievements. Okay. And as you can see on the back of the rule books, you have small envelopes that are numbered. So in those envelopes, when you put a sticker here, you will open it and reveal new stuff. Sometimes it will help you. I don't want to say it too much, but there's 13 different envelopes. Okay. I play with my sons. In three days, they play 27 games. Okay. It's really addictive. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And then, as you say, you can repack it and yes, and exactly. Do it again. You can repack it, and even if when you're done, you open everything. You can customize the 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 game as you you like it. So you don't like this add-on, you can remove it and custom your games how you like to do it because you never destroy anything so it's okay. it's worth it it's a great experience for the kids okay yeah. right. thank you very much thank carl you thank you for the overview zombie kids evolution